Hello everybody, this is your boy Kenneth O'Pointer from the K2 Spot giving you all a brand new video and it's on R&B Soul Singer. Her name is Maylot and this review that you guys are watching me is reviewing her new album called Maven which is released today, November 28th, 2016 and it's just a collection of 11 songs of amazing music, just that collection period. If you guys like jazz but you like R&B Soul you, and have a little elements of hip hop You'll definitely love this album for real because I feel like it's just honest and it's very truthful. And I know Mayla has um, written a lot of the songs either from what she's gone through personally or what she's known family or friends who have gone through it personally. So I feel like it's a very honest album and I feel like a lot of the albums we hear now, a lot of them are okay. But I feel like this album right here is one of the best ones. I feel like everybody's going to be like, wow, especially to end November and going into December and going into New Year. I feel like this is a great project right here which you guys will definitely love now let me get to the straight to the project because i know everybody wants to get straight to the point and go straight to why i'm feeling may Lot's music now track number one is called may i and it's a great way of introducing the project now i think the song is only like a minute i think 21 seconds or 31 seconds i could be wrong on that so don't quote me bad on that one but i like how it's just very you hear from, hear from the depths of her soul like just increase of how you hear her singing and the music just comes in and I feel like it's very organized that way. And then when you get to track number two called To Whom We May Concern, I love that song. It has that R&B soul, like that R&B pop, a soul feel to it. But at the same time, I hear some jazz elements to it with Maylot's voice because I feel like it's, you hear the voice of somebody who's listening to jazz where you feel the depths of them really singing from maybe pain or maybe just from the lyrics. And I feel like I love artists who are like that because I feel like Maylot's one of those artists who's just... When I mean the truth, she's the truth. And I feel like she's one of those artists who, and I'm going to put this out there, I feel like she will get a Grammy nomination soon. Now, I don't think this year, but probably soon. And she's going to be somebody you guys going to definitely want to say, your boy Kenneth got you in too. But we hear track number three called um, Hide My Face. It gets better and better. And then you get the depths of it when you hear the song called Twisted Metal featuring Kyle Lucas. And I feel like the two of them really complement each other vocally. And the production is just on point. Now we get a track number five called When in Rome. And I like how that song is just very honest. And it's just raw and organic. And I mean really organic in a way where you hear singing but at the same time you hear production. But I feel like you get an essence of maybe a storytelling going on throughout that song. Especially when you hear the next song called Direction. Also, you, I feel like it's the same way. But when you get to uh, the interlude called Hopefully I'm saying right, Najin, 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 I'll call it, in this parentheses, I am. Very um, straight to the point, and it's very honest. And I said, okay, I'm getting a feel of what you're trying to say. But it gets really, I mean, it gets really great and juicy on the song called Kanjo. Because I re reviewed that song a couple months ago. You guys can check that out if you finish watching this video. But it was just Mayla singing it by herself. But this is a, I feel like it's a continuation, but it's a duet version featuring Xavier Omar and I feel like the two of them really complement each other where I feel like it's very soulful but very sexy yet to the point where it's just not doing too much but it's just letting the music speak for itself and if a lot of you guys don't really know Kanjo is I hope like, hopefully I'm saying the right Ethiopia for beat means beautiful so I say that's really a great song I feel like you guys will love love that one and then you get songs like Distant Star Feature Memory which is another great track but it's the song right here which I know means a whole lot to Mayla and the song called Sit Down and it's featuring Sylvan LeCou and I feel like that's you hear Maylot's mother father and I think it's her I think she said her sister or cousin just have family I know it's family and friends and everybody on that and I feel like it's just great how she involved her family in that um as of that song I said okay girl because it got that hip hop element too I was like okay Mayla I see you and then the last track is called No Bad News. And I feel like that song is just basically saying, and all the songs are just going to let you know where there may be, you may feel down, but there's always hope in the um, end. So don't feel like everything that you're going through is just uh, kicking you in the butt or it's, it's going to be forever or it's just going to be like that the whole entire time. There's always happiness in the end. And that's basically what that song is saying. That's basically how the album Maven is. It's saying that we go through hard stuff, but we may go through good times. But at the same time, there is a um, resolution to everything. And there's, we do still have to evolve as individuals. 
and hopefully you guys get that when you hear this album. Now the album is out digitally, like iTunes, Apple Music, Spotify, all the above. Make sure you guys go out and support my girl um, Maylot's album Maven because it's really, really great. And I have the link down in the description box so you don't have to worry about trying to figure out like the iTunes link for all my people that got iTunes. Now, if you guys want to keep up with her, you keep uh, check out our website at www.beholdmaylot.com. And that's also her Twitter and her Instagram. So her Twitter and Instagram is beholdmaylot, M-E-L-A-T. But I have everything down here, so you don't have to worry about trying to write everything down. And also make sure you subscribe to my girl Maylot's YouTube channel so you get a feel of what she does musically. And hear the music of how she just puts her soul out there for you guys. And hopefully you guys... It's also from Diary Entries, so that way you get a feel of what my friend is all about. And if you guys want to keep up with me, and hope you guys do, I am on Twitter and Instagram at KTooks. Be sure that you're watching on YouTube, the KTooks Spot. It does have a Twitter page at KTooks Spot. And also make sure you please thumb this video by liking it. Make sure you share the video and make sure you comment after you've heard the full album from Maylot called Maven. Let me know what you guys really think about the album. And definitely know, let me know what your favorite tracks are because I definitely want to know what you guys really think about it. And also make sure you please subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't already. It's so simple. You push the subscribe button down here and then you push the bell icon to get notifications for every time I drop videos. And you can even see my previous videos when I first started YouTube and up till now. Just in case this may be your first time watching me and you want to get a feel with your boy Kenneth and the K2 Spot is all about, you're more than welcome to do that. And hope you guys continue to support, subscribe. Watch the videos and show your boy mad love. And that's all I have to say. So shout out to Maylot. And this is your boy Kenneth signing off from the K2 spot. And you guys will see me again next time when I drop a little new video too. So bye-bye.